this training is organized in framework of European Economic Area program and we highly appreciate this opportunity to attract high qualified expert as Michal. Actually Michal has provided trainings all across Europe and provided assistance not only for us but also for the other countries and uh, we highly appreciate this opportunity to increase our knowledge in particularly in crypto, asset area and blockchain uh, developments. We have done quite a lot during the last years to increase our knowledge and skills to identify and manage money laundering and sanction evasion risks. But we have to enhance also our knowledge on uh, crypto assets and technologies. These areas are developing very fast and there are two additional reasons why we have to continue to strengthen our knowledge and skills in respect of uh, crypto assets. And first of it is EU has adopted MICA regulation and we have to apply this regulation so in, in Europe uh, this is one of the reasons and the second reason Central Bank of Latvia is overtaking supervision from the tax revenue service and starting from December Central Bank will be the supervisor for cryptocurrency um, companies and these are two additional reasons why we have to increase our knowledge and skills in respect of this particular area. We see also the benefit for market, so we can provide assistance for the uh, market, uh, provide guidance or expectations, so what we expect for the market, uh, market players, and also draw attention for market uh, participants on the risks we see in the market, and we expect that they pay particular attention for uh, to the certain certain risk factors. During the training we are covering different topics. Uh, for instance, we are discussing what are the information we have to assess as the supervisors, uh, to understand, assess and manage risks in crypto field. Then we also learn experience from the other countries, the best and the bad practice. From, from other countries' experience. Then we also uh, learn about the main principles on blockchain operations to understand how the blockchains operate. So yeah, such kind of topics are covered uh, during our training. <laughs>